Hello everyone, my name is Jack Hapani and I am the Lacadaisical Photographer. Welcome to the channel. So, today, 5th August 2020, though it, the year is 2020, still it's a great day for me. It's a very special day. What can we say? So, today I got my first camera kit. Yes, I got my first camera kit and my level of excitement is just over the roof and I am so excited to unbox it. So let's unbox the camera. So here we have the box of Lumix S1, a full frame camera. Well, Sony users don't get this type of luxury for sure. When we open the box, we have these black boxes and shit, some shit, some trash. The first box I'm going to take out is the one with the lens. Well, I'll show you the lens after a while, so I will just put it aside. The second box, let's open and see what's inside. And weirdly, everything is just upside down here. I don't know why, but yeah. So here we have manuals, three manuals, but do we need the manuals? I guess the answer is no. The second box is should be the one with accessories, and it's quite heavy, so I'm guessing there are a lot of accessories. So opening the box, the first thing I'm going to take out is the battery. This is a 3050mAh battery and it is quite huge, like seriously very huge. This must have so much juice in it that it can go for a day. Wire, another wire, well of the same sort, so why? Uh, it's just weird similar wire again and this is the main battery charger with indication of 50 80 and 100 percent and then again a wire but this is something different so yeah and this brackety thing i don't know just and this adapter well it's quite heavy i like it and again the same wire so yeah the last thing here is a lumix strap well this is made in china i don't like it either i know so this strap is quite thin and things are written like lumix s1 lumix people should know what camera i'm using but to be honest it's quite trash it's it's all trash so well keeping all things aside the only thing left in this box is camera but wait first unbox the lens so opening the box here we have the kit lens which is 24 to 105 with a constant aperture of f4 this lens hood comes with a locking mechanism and a release button <laughs> it's just better and the lens is packed with bubble wrap ah, i just love bubble wrap it's so it's so soothing wait i have to do an unboxing so yeah first take a look at this lens well it is a lightweight lens that i have to keep in mind it's it's better and this is the lens which has three switches first is lock unlock second is ois and the third is autofocus to manual focus it's just a great lens for beginning keeping this aside now it's the turn for the main thing the main camera well let's throw some trash out of the box and this too yeah here it is the second wife the taj mahal this is so heavy like seriously it's quite the opposite of a mirrorless camera. It's a bridge. But if it was a tank, it must have made destruction. Complete destruction. I just love this. Voila. And the grip. The grip is mm, just lovely. That's my favorite part. And we have a tilting LED which can tilt this way too i don't know what for but yeah it's quite a nice touch and extra and also we have the waist level angle it's just nice 
we have these three buttons jog dials three jog dials and just amazing grip i i can't stop with the grip here we have switches for uh different shirt uh different modes which has a lock on it so yeah that's a good thing a full powered hdmi and a usb type c port and the audio in and out via 3.5 mm audio jacks we have two slots one for xqd and sd uhs2 well it slides open not like the other cameras and the battery we have the massive battery goes in here and there are some pins for mounts and adapters and all it's quite a nice touch and we also have a horseshoe mount so yeah here is the lumix s1 chunky big guy just amazing i love it